Get it there SMA and Justin Trudeau will have a good trading relationship Justin Trudeau is gearing up for a seamless transition of trade between the two nations and a more impactful agreement than Canada holds with the bloc. International Development Secretary Liam Fox has backed the call, saying there is huge appetite for increasing trade with its Commonwealth ally, Mr Trudeau said. Trade deals are always challenging but it should be fairly easy for all of us to get to an improved approach on trade between Canada and the UK. The Canadian leader signalled an ambitious approach to trade, saying a carbon copy of the Comprehensive Economic and Trade Agreement, CETA, with the bloc was appropriate in the short term but he wanted to go further, he said, there will be things in CETA that are no longer as necessary between Canada and the UK and there'd be other areas where we would be interested in going further. The rolled over or specific CETA arrangement between Canada and the UK is just the floor, or the first step. After that, we very much look forward to negotiating an even better or larger or more impactful deal to encourage the deepening of trade ties between Canada and the UK. Whitehall officials are attempting to convince non-EU member states to roll over their current deals with the bloc during the transition, Getty Justin Trudeau wants an ambitious trade deal and Canada is the second nation this week to signal it backs the idea, after Norway also made positive noises on the move, the country's finance minister Siv Jensen said her government had no objections to a flexible transition period, in a London speech. She said other countries had a common interest in the UK continuing to endorse the idea of common rules and a level playing field. Get in Norway is also positive about Brexit trade there had been fears countries would demand concessions from Britain in return for rolling over their deals, one such country is India, which is pushing for a relaxation on visa restrictions. Its Deputy High Commissioner, Dinesh Patnaik warned this week that it would not prioritize the UK and thrashing out an agreement would be a long and tedious process.